Facing the Atlantic Ocean in southern Africa, Angola looks to the sky. Luanda's new Antonio Agostinho Neto International Airport extends through a total area of 30 kilometers squared and is ready to receive aircraft from all over the world. Its name pays homage to the father of the nation, who became the first president of the Republic of Angola in 1975. During the long struggle for independence, he dreamed of connecting the new country to the region and to the world. That vision is now a reality under the leadership of Angolan President João Manuel Gonçalves Lorenzo and his government. The new airport will become a driver of investment opportunities in the aviation, industrial, tourism and business sectors. Political stability, together with economic reforms, have fostered in recent years a reliable and exciting business environment. The opportunities are endless. Angola is a nation of the future full of ambition and energy, driven by the collective force of millions of young people. 65% of the population is under 25. Situated in the heart of Southern Africa, Angola is a natural hub with a sphere of influence that extends well beyond its borders. With the new international airport, Angola will cement its pivotal position as a connecting hub for regional and intercontinental flights, enabling airlines from around the world to centralize their operations in the Angolan capital. Those international airlines will join TARG, Angola's historic flag carrier, which operates an extensive international network. TARG's modern fleet will connect Luanda to various destinations in Africa, Europe, Middle East and Latin America. TARG and other domestic airlines will also link the skies of Angola through a network of 14 domestic and three international airports. Angola has approved its participation in the single African air transport market, opening even more routes and connections to the benefit of the 415 million residents of southern and central Africa. Further, the bilateral air service agreements that Angola has signed with more than 40 countries allow for more than 330 weekly flights to or from the new airport, which will be prepared to process up to 15 million annual passengers. A railway service to Luanda downtown, along with a road network, is also contemplated. With fast and efficient connections, the new airport will be an important logistics hub for the transport and distribution of up to 130,000 tons of cargo per year, helping boost the economic and commercial activity in Africa. In addition, a 75 km square size airport city will be built around the airport with logistic and aircraft maintenance infrastructure, as well as hotels and convention centers. The new airport will also enable tourism development, providing a gateway for visitors who want to discover Angola, a true gem on the African continent with more than 20 natural wonders. Recognizing the importance of environmental stability, it will be a reference in energy efficiency and reduction of environmental impact. The aim is to become a green airport. To ensure the best standards of efficiency and safety, the Angolan government will soon launch an international public tender to select an operator that can run the new Luandis Airport, Africa's third biggest in passenger transport capacity under the terms of current legislation. The latest addition to a strong and well-structured airport network, marking a new era for the development of civil aviation in Angola and on the African continent. Antonio Agostinho Neto International Airport is now a reality. Angola can now take off toward the future. And we shall fly together ever higher from Angola to the world. Ministry of Transport, Government of Angola.